So this is the material I bought from Home Depot for this uh, raised uh, garden bed. Um, so um, this one I bought from Home Depot. These are uh, one eight, one inch and eight uh, inches width and uh, eight feet long. So I asked the Home Depot person to cut them into half. So I bought four of them made into eight pieces of those and uh, I also bought uh, one long uh, two by four and cut them into four pieces 16 inches long each so I have four of them I also bought a rack uh, from a store nearby store so that will help me just remove all of these wood chips um, and then I can just go down to the solid ground and also got some worker, workers gloves this will really become handy because these woods are really chippy that can really hurt your uh, um, hand quickly so i uh, also bought uh, i want 20 piece 20 of these two and a half inch long screws wood, wood screws bought them from home depot i didn't find uh, 20 pack i got a 50 pack and uh, i have uh, uh, the electric screwdriver that i have actually bought from my neighbor so these are all the material we why we want for this project i'm going to just you know rack all these wood chips first and uh, find a find a flat ground that i can uh, start building this project thank you Like all these wood chips I thought it would be really like a breeze but it, it's actually a bit of a hard work if you have a nice very strong rack uh, it's going to make your life easier as you can see uh, I picked exactly the same size wood boards from Home Depot but you can see that uh, this one is a lot thinner than this so if you just you know when you buy it just make sure you're getting a um, same uh, thick you can see the 16 inch screw 16 inch uh, uh, 2 by 4 I kept that as a support in the corner uh, screw them in so that's how the whole setup would look so there you go that is my first ever raised garden bed start filling in dirt and we'll get some soil and fill the rest so finally built uh, built all the sides it has good amount of uh, depth in there and as you can see the corners are not really very nicely done so the screws are not fully in there yet so it's, as you can see here this is my first project uh, any of this kind so the, the side it's not leveled correctly so all these things that me may have to take uh, uh, into account when you build this so I started uh, filling in with a uh, lot of other dirt uh, tweaks and other uh, wood chips and all that that is around so I'll just fill with this how it how much uh, maybe half of uh, the depth with these dirt and stuff and I'm going to get a um, garden soil that I would just uh, pour on top of it so I'm also planning to build another garden raised bed um, uh, half of the size uh, just right side Maybe somewhere somewhere close here so yeah this is all it is so I, it took me about two hours to build the whole thing if you have an extra hand if, uh, if your friend is around you can just take help it will be very easy for you so that's my first uh, raised garden bed there you go